Hey what's up guys, in today's video I am going to show how to create discount code through Shopify REST admin API. So there are two things, discount code and price rule. And in this playlist we, ha we are going to cover about how to create products, collection, orders, discount and pages. So before wasting any time, let's dive into. So as you can see this is the official documentation of Shopify REST admin API discount code. And this are the endpoint, we are going to click on it. And the Shopify provides the different version of the code like Curl, Remix, Ruby, Node.js and then we are going to use Curl into our Postman. So you may hear about Postman, it is used to test APIs. Just click on import and click on paste. So as you can see this is our endpoint, we are going to change few things like store name which is fine gap and the authentication system like a sas token it is used in any endpoint of shopify rest admin api so just paste it there and uh, then click on body so just beautify it and these are the discount codes like summer one two three and just click on send and let's see what will happen so it is saying not found 404 so as you can see it requires the price rule id so let's create the price rule first then we will use this endpoint so just click on this one and copy it paste it like the same way and change the store name and the assess token store name is a fine gap and the assess token from there body in the body you can see beautified and let's see price rule title value value is in the percentage the target type is the line type and the date and these are the other things which may be mandatory so just click on send and then you can see uh, unprocessable entity which is the product with the id this one it means the product id is the invalid so just go to the products so let's copy the product id from there and paste it there and after that we have to give it collection id but first of all let's uh, remove it and let's see what will happen so it is saying base must be at least one atom precursor tied. So as you can see it is giving us this error. So let's revert it and uh, let's see what is the collection ID. Home page. Let's copy paste it there. So as you can see it is giving 201 which means created. And let's see on the discount so this is the discount we just created and let's copy the discount code I mean ID and paste it in the previous endpoint in the body sorry not in the body in the URL like this way so as you can see it is also created and let's refresh it and see where it is coming like this count codes and uh, view all codes and you can see some more one two three so by this way you can create the discount code and price rule in the shopify through rest admin api so you can retrieve the price rules as well and update it and delete it as well so if you want to delete and update the price rule or discount, you may need the discount ID or price uh, price rule ID. So by this way, you can create discount codes. And if you want to put this code into your code, then you can use this icon and get the code in any language like this way. JavaScript, PHP, Curl, C Sharp, Java, Ruby, Python, etc.
so let's copy it and you can put in the local host as well so it will run on the local host as well you just need to refresh it so as you can see it is saying discount code creation again so by this way you can create discount codes in shopify rest admin api and if you guys find this video useful don't forget to like subscribe and share finally thanks for watching